Meantime, the first in-person Election Day ballots already cast just about an hour ago in the tiny New Hampshire town of Dixville Notch. Total votes, eight. Who won? Let's go to our Rachel Crane because it is the midnight vote that is a late night tradition that dates back to 1960 when voters went for Nixon over Kennedy nine to zero. Rachel Crane is in Dixville Notch for us tonight. So who won? Well, Poppy, the ballots were cast, the votes were tallied, Clinton getting four votes, Trump getting two, Johnson getting one, and one of the Dixville Notch residents wrote in Mitt Romney. So there you have mm. it here in Dick Dixville Notch. Clinton is beating Trump. But you know, uh, Poppy, I got to point out that Dixville Notch is not the only town that participates in this midnight voting tradition. There's also Hart's location as well as Millsfield. And they do this because there's this quirky law in New Hampshire that says that if a town has less than 100 people, they can close the polls once all of the registered voters have voted. And Poppy, I'll point out, though, that yeah, collectively in uh, these three towns that participate in midnight voting here in New Hampshire, Trump is beating Hillary Clinton. Trump getting 32 votes and Hillary Clinton having 25. Now, Team Clinton, Rachel, uh, paying attention to what happened in, in tiny Dixville Notch tonight, right? One of the advisors tweeting that they like the outcome. Nick yes, Merrill they did, writing, tweeting out that they were happy about it. Oh, yeah, sorry. Nick, Nick ahead, Merrill Bobby. writing, Clinton campaign feeling very good about Election Day results thus far. They do have a few more. A few more votes that need to be cast, though. That's right. And he he sent that tweet before those votes were tallied in Hart's location and Millsfield. But of course, uh, you know, it, it, it is a coveted spot to win Dixville Notch's uh, vote here. So they are right in being proud of it. But as I pointed out, Trump is beating Hillary right now in mm -hmm. the polls that have been tallied on Election Day 2016 in New Hampshire right mm -hmm. now. Yeah, New Hampshire is, again, a really important state uh, for both of them this time around. It could go either way. Rachel, thank you very much. It has all been leading up to this. It is officially Election Day in America. Can you believe it? On this election eve, election morning, from the Concord patch, the results from New Hampshire. We told you earlier that in Dixville Notch, Hillary Clinton with a lead, four votes compared to two votes for Donald Trump. But other locations in New Hampshire, Millsfield and Hart's location, adding to the results in Dixville Notch, now give Donald Trump a lead. Again, these are very early morning votes that take place in the tiny hamlets uh, in the northern uh, and central part of New Hampshire, just after midnight uh, where the votes are cast. And Donald Trump in those towns, 32 votes to 25 votes, according to the Concord patch. And Libertarian Gary Johnson getting four votes. Bernie Sanders receiving three write-in votes. Uh, and Mitt Romney getting one vote. And one voter cast a ballot for Kasich Sanders, according to reports on Twitter. So we'll watch the scene in Grand Rapids, Michigan. Hear from you, Elaine from Harmony, Pennsylvania. You've been very patient. Good morning. I have. It's past my bedtime here. Thank, I want to say thank you to C-SPAN, despite what some of the other callers have said. 